So today I want to say, be careful. Be careful of what you tell yourself. Be careful of what you speak to yourself. Because what does come flesh? What does come true? Everything you say is a confession. Everything you say is a confirmation of what you don't want to yourself. Take for example the people who say, I don't really like money. I never like money. Or I don't care about money. I think you have heard somebody saying, I don't care about money. And when you say you don't care about money, there is a probability that money will not come into your life. Why? Because when you care about something, you take care of it. When you say, I care about you, you are always very keen to observe values of that person. You look at that person that you don't get annoyed with that. It's the same thing with money. So if you say, I don't care about money or I never like money, money will never like you back. And that is truth. Those are truth. Let me give you an example in the Bible. We are told in the Bible that the word, there was a word and the word became flesh. Meaning, it was a word but it became physically human being. Jesus is a word. And at the same time, Jesus came in a human being, in a physical being. From a word to a physical being. Power of word. Second thing, a good example again is in the Bible. Because in the Bible, there's a lot of life-changing information if we keenly listen to them or read them. We are told in the mouth, in the tongues, in the lips, there is death and life. You see, sometimes, guys, we tell ourselves things that will manifest themselves in our life. A negative thing we tell ourselves. If you call your child, this is, you are good for nothing. Definitely that child will be good for nothing. Because that child will grow up as feeling that he or she is good for nothing. So they will not work hard. Because their parents told them they are good for nothing. If you call your child mujrim, definitely that child will become mujrim. That's a word you confessed. That's a word you tell, you spoke. You spoke the word. God said, let there be light. And there was a light. That's how God did the creation. He created everything with a spoken word. And that's why it is always important for us to say positive things about ourselves. Don't say you are a dumb guy. Oh, oh, I'm really stupid. No, you will definitely become a stupid because you are telling yourself you are a stupid. So what am I trying to tell you today? What I'm trying to tell you, colleagues, or you who is listening, uh, a listener or a viewer, is be careful of what you tell yourself. Be extra careful of what you say you tell yourself because you are confessing. You're making confession about who you are and what you want to manifest in your life. If you want to be successful, always say, I am successful. Even if you are not, mentally you are working on becoming successful. You are affirming that you are successful. If you want to be rich, confess. Say, I am rich. I am rich. And indeed you are rich. You are alive. You are healthy. Definitely you are rich. You are rich because what happened? You just need to work toward your goal. And that goal is you want to be rich. You want to be financially free. You want to have a financial freedom. You want to have... You see, the beauty of money is simple. Money gives you options. That is it. Money gives you options. You can choose to eat Japanese food and not your African food. It's an option. Money gave you that option. You can travel where you want to go. Money gives you option. That is the beauty of money. Money actually gives you that power of contribution to serve human beings. You know you cannot give what you don't have. But if you have something, you'll give. If you have money, you can be able to give to serve so many people. So never tell negative things about money. Money is a facilitator. 
it facilitate what you want. It might not make you happy, but it also depend. If you use your money badly, negatively, it will actually hurt you. But if you use it positively, people will appreciate you because you are making impact in their life. That is the positive thing about money. So again, the topic today is not purely money. The topic today is be careful of what you say to yourself. Negative things are going to be manifested in your life because word does come flesh.